Mr. Bigley. Hey there guys and gals, it's Kerbigly with another vlog, and I'm sorry that I didn't get this up earlier, but, uh, yeah, life has been crazy busy since I returned from New York City. As many of you know, Morgan and I went to New York City to celebrate her birthday last weekend, and we had a blast, and I've just been crushed with work since I got back, so I finally have a chance to sit down and get something up to update you guys with. So as far as New York City goes, unfortunately I didn't get any footage up of it. Uh, the reason for that is due to the fact that we were just so busy while we were there. We were seriously running from place to place, just having a blast, and I was like, you know what? If you guys want to see what New York City is like, you can check out my vlog from, I think it was like six-ish months ago that we went last time. And uh, it's really kind of the same thing, you know, just a ton of tall buildings, lots and lots of people, some really cool companies and businesses all doing their thing, and a lot of stores to go into. So not really anything different than that, although we did get to see something new. We always see something new every time we go. It wasn't anything that I thought was going to make like a new unique vlog. This time I did buy some awesome souvenirs though while I was in the city. I am so pumped. I got to go to the Nintendo World Store, which I haven't gotten to do for a couple of years. It it is awesome. It's like my favorite, favorite place there. It's got all this really cool, unique, exclusive Nintendo memorabilia there, and I bought some stuff, so I'm gonna show you guys. So first off, I decided to spring for a Zelda hat, which is awesome. Check this out. It's got the logo. It's uh, fitted so that it fits on my head pretty much perfectly, not with my headset on, obviously but it's really high quality. I like it, it was very inexpensive, and I just dig it. I really, really love Legend of Zelda. I haven't done any games on my channel yet, but I really wanna get back into some retro gaming on the channel, so maybe I'll throw a Legend of Zelda playthrough on here. I'll do maybe um, the original, maybe some number two, which was eh, and then uh, maybe some Link to the Past or something like that. We'll figure it out together, but I'm so excited to have something cool like this in my collection. I also bought Ah, it's Meta Knight from Kirby. I'm so pumped. I love Kirby. It's one of my favorite series from when I was a kid. I used to play uh, Kirby Superstar on my Super Nintendo all the freaking time. I used to beat that game over and over and over again just because I loved it so much. I love that there's like six game modes in it. Uh, but Meta Knight was always one of my favorite characters because he wasn't really like truly a villain. Like he's a bad guy to start with, but he becomes kind of like a rival slash anti-hero as the series goes on. And I really dig that about him. He's got this awesome sword. He's got a cool cape. He's got his signature face mask on that hides his like blue Kirby face and he's wearing his battle armor. It's just, it's really cool craftsmanship. I love it. He's a little plushy, so he's so cute and I have him propped up on uh, one of the dressers in my bedroom right now. Last but not least, when I was visiting the Disney store in Times Square, which was crazy, uh, it was like midnight, and since it was one of the few places that was open, everybody was there, it was just jam-packed and just like, uh, it was claustrophobia, and I don't suffer from claustrophobia, but damn, I was kind of getting it in that store, just because there's like so many people not watching where they're going, and it kind of bugs me that that happens, but hey, it's a tourist trap, so what can you do? Anyway, while we were there, I decided to buy a Pop Vinyl figure. I bought this little Pop Vinyl Guardians of the Galaxy Rocket Raccoon. I love Rocky. He's one of my favorite characters, like in comics even. Uh, he's just a funny little guy. He's uh, known for his own comic book series before Guardians of the Galaxy, but I'm really happy that the movie, as good as it was, managed to blast him up into prominence as far as the Marvel Universe goes. So it's really cool. He's got a bobblehead feature. Um, they didn't have a regular one, but look at how tiny he is. Like, compared to my other Pop Vinyl figures, like, he's, like, really, really tiny. So he's a cool part of the collection. Anyway, that's about it, guys. I don't really have a ton to update you on because, uh, yeah, the channel's just kind of been doing its own thing thing. I recently got another free influencer product. As those of you remember, I had the deodorant video that I did a while ago. I'll put a link up here if you guys haven't checked it out, but I did a Gerbigli sells out video and I plan on doing another one because I got another product from the company and I'm really looking forward to making another sort of goofy video on it. Um, but we'll see. We'll see what's going on. Besides that, just, you know, game series are doing their things. I'm trying to get through as many as I can. I'm going to try not to juggle 10 at a time because that's obviously way too many. I'm trying to cut it down so that I only have like three going on at once. It's, uh, it's been crazy. It's been crazy busy recently, but I hope to catch up with you guys. I know a lot of you have started school, so good luck with that. And yeah, that's going to be it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please be sure to hit the like button, share the video favorite. Also, be sure to subscribe to me if you guys haven't already. For those of you who have, thank you so much for all of your support. You guys are the best in the world. I love every single one of you. And as always, it was great seeing you. Bye-bye. So first up, I decided to spring for... Da -da -da -da, I, I, I hit the mic.